That's it. This is what she's gonna look like. We're all loaded up here. All right, here it is. Made it to the shop. All right, what do you think about doing a series on the jet boat build? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, it'll be trial and error series for sure. Yeah, sounds good. Yeah, this is going to be part one of the mini jet boat build. We're going to do everything from the kit to installing the Sea-Doo motor or the donor motor. And then, yeah, it's going to be a good time. Probably take a few weeks, I'd say. Probably longer, who knows. But uh, we're going to get her done. Got a new welder over there, Miller 222. 220. 220. And uh, we're going to go over everything. Not super sure yet. Part one going down. Tack the transom on half inch in from the rear of the hull. This is quarter inch and the transom is an eighth. So we tacked on the transom just along the back, half inch in. And then we just put one little brace to help it up. And now we're making the brace to hold the hull apart. So we're thinking it's gonna be something like this, like this, and then we'll start bringing the, the bow together. Just figured out how to bring the bow together correctly. So we just welded this piece on so we can take off uh, the clamp just so we have a bit more security when we're finishing welding this and banging it around a bit. Ooh. Oh, just tacking up the bow. We got a brace bolted in. That's super crucial. Definitely got to put that in. Put the grind in. Pretty crazy how much pressure is in this boat. Boat or brace. All right, that was the end of day one. What'd you think? Well, you know, a couple steps uh, backwards, one step forward kind of day. But... Ran into some issues here. Had to do some more bracing because our angle piece of aluminum bent our brace that we thought was going to be solid. That was a bit of an issue. We lost some distance across. Uh, we didn't go anything below what they recommend at Jetstream. So yeah, day one complete. All right, we're just on step three. Going to throw in the doubler plate and the uh, stringers. Got all the stringers, just peeled all the plastic off. Here's the doubler plate. And then after that will be the sides. Definitely not a journeyman welder. You know, this is my first time welding ever. Step on that, it goes right down. Step on this and I think we'll just get the welder. We're 
on to the stringers. <laughs> Gonna lay out all four and tack them in. Got the measurements in. Maybe I'll throw those in text on the video. Probably not, pretty lazy, but we'll see. Solid boats for sure. So I can't wait for the sides to go on so it actually looks like a boat. <laughs> I don't think I'm up for it. No, pretty beat actually.